Imagine stumbling upon a device so advanced and perplexing that it could be mistaken for alien technology. What if I told you such a device exists, and it's over 2,000 years old? Welcome back to Presapien. Today, we're diving into the deep seas of the ancient world to uncover the mystery of the Antikythera mechanism. If you enjoy diving into ancient history, hit that subscribe button and turn on notifications so you never miss an exciting discovery. Stay with us to the end as we reveal the most shocking theory about this mysterious device, which could fundamentally change how we understand ancient civilizations. The year is 1901, when mysteries were waiting to be discovered, and one such mystery was lurking beneath the azure waves of the Mediterranean Sea near the small Greek island of Antikythera. A group of sponge divers, braving the cold depths for their valuable harvest, came across something unexpected. As they descended through the ethereal underwater light, the shadowy outline of an ancient shipwreck emerged from the murk. This wasn't just any shipwreck. It was a time capsule from antiquity, a vessel that had once sailed the Mediterranean, filled with extraordinary riches, beautifully sculpted statues frozen in time, amphorae filled with the remnants of their ancient contents, exquisite jewelry intricately crafted by artisans long since past. But amidst this submerged treasury was an object that would become one of the greatest enigmas of archaeological history. A strange lump of corroded bronze stood out among the treasures. It wasn't immediately beautiful nor shone like the other artifacts. Its true value was hidden within. Little did the divers know. They had just discovered what is often considered the world's first analog computer. An artifact that would baffle, confuse, and fascinate scientists and historians for the century to come. Now that we've set the scene for the dramatic discovery, let's delve deeper into the Antikythera mechanism and why it continues to puzzle us even today. But before we proceed, can you imagine the feeling those divers might have experienced upon finding such a strange object? Share your thoughts in the comments below. As our brave divers surfaced, clutching this puzzling find, no one could have predicted the sheer complexity of what lay within that lump of corroded bronze, aimed after the nearby island. The Antikythera mechanism looked like something straight out of a steampunk dream, an intricate assembly of over 30 bronze gears, all perfectly interlocked. When it was discovered, it bore little resemblance to the elegant mechanism it once was. Centuries under the sea had encrusted it in a shell of corrosion, obscuring its intricate inner workings. Yet even in this state, it radiated a sense of being something more exceptional. It was only in the advent of 21st century technology that we fully appreciated the mechanism's intricacies. Using X-ray and 3D imaging technologies, scientists slowly unveiled the hidden grandeur of the mechanism. It appeared to be a sophisticated device, possibly a computer, full of tiny, interlocking gears and mysterious inscriptions. Who could have made such a device? And for what purpose? Was it a toy for a king? A tool for a scholar? or perhaps a guide for a mariner navigating the vast Mediterranean Sea? The answers to these questions took time to be clear. Like a good detective story, the Antikythera mechanism guarded its secrets well. Our journey to understand this fascinating artifact has only begun, so stay with us as we unravel its mysteries. And as we proceed, remember to subscribe if you still need to do so to join us in exploring the world's ancient wonders, peeling back the layers of time and corrosion. Researchers began deciphering the Antikythera mechanism. It was a task that would take decades. Enlisting the expertise of historians, archaeologists, linguists, and astrophysicists, bit by bit, the true nature of this ingenious device started to come to light. The Antikythera mechanism, it turned out, was an astoundingly accurate astronomical calculator. It could track the movements of the sun, the moon, and possibly even the planets through the zodiac, predict eclipses, and even replicate the irregular orbit of the moon. This wasn't just a simple machine, but an ancient Greek computer. Can you imagine that? Over 2,000 years ago, an engineer, we don't know who, designed and constructed a device that could precisely model the cosmos. This was at a time when Rome was still a republic, and the great library of Alexandria was still standing. But the Antikythera mechanism wasn't just about tracking celestial bodies. It also had a social purpose. Predicting solar and lunar eclipses served a religious function. These events were often seen as omens. It could also follow the four-year cycle of the ancient Olympic Games. 
It was a comprehensive guide to the passage of time and the events that defined the ancient Greek world. But even with this understanding, the Antikythera mechanism was about to present an even bigger mystery. A question that would challenge everything we thought we knew about the technological capabilities of the ancient world. As we delve deeper, if you're enjoying this journey into the past, remember to hit that like button and share this video with others who share your passion for history. Your support helps us uncover more mysteries from the ancient world, and we genuinely appreciate it. The Antikythera mechanism isn't just an object of fascination and intrigue. It is a stark reminder that our ancestors were far more advanced than we often give them credit for. The precision and complexity of the mechanism suggest a level of mathematical and engineering knowledge that was thought to have been beyond the reach of the ancient Greeks. What's more, the Antikythera mechanism also challenges our understanding of the history of technology. For centuries, the conventional wisdom held that complex machinery of this sort only emerged in the 14th century with the advent of mechanical clocks in Europe. Yet here was a device, built over a millennium earlier, using a technology that seems to have been lost in time. Moreover, the mechanism's ability to accurately track and predict celestial events illustrates a profound understanding of astronomy. It represents an intersection of science and culture, showing us how intertwined our ancestors' lives were with the stars and planets above. The Antikythera mechanism forces us to rethink what we believe about our past. It compels us to ask, what other treasures of knowledge did the ancients possess that were lost to time? And even more intriguingly, what if more devices like the Antikythera mechanism are still waiting to be discovered? As we venture deeper into the enigma of the Antikythera mechanism, we're met with a constellation of mysteries and intriguing theories. In all its corroded glory, the mechanism has silently kept secrets for over 2,000 years while we have deciphered many of its functions. The questions of who created it, where, and why still tantalize researchers. One theory that has gained traction suggests that the device could have been the brainchild of the legendary ancient inventor Archimedes or a student of his work. However, this theory is shrouded in debate as Archimedes was known to have been active in Syracuse, not Rhodes as indicated by the inscriptions on the mechanism. But regardless of its creator, one thing is clear. The level of sophistication and knowledge needed to construct the Antikythera mechanism points to a flourishing tradition of advanced technology in the ancient world. A technology that, sadly, was lost to the sands of time. The most mind-boggling theory is that the Antikythera mechanism may not be unique. Some scholars believe there might be more of these ancient computers waiting to be discovered. If true, this prospect could open a new chapter in our understanding of ancient history. And now, as we reach the end of our journey into the secrets of the Antikythera mechanism, we face an extraordinary theory that might just reshape how we view the ancient world. Imagine for a moment that the Antikythera mechanism was not unique but merely a glimpse of a widespread technology. If one device of such complexity existed over 2,000 years ago, could there have been more? And could these devices have been part of a network of ancient computers spread across the Mediterranean? This staggering theory posits that there may have been a golden age of gears in antiquity, a period where sophisticated mechanical devices like the Antikythera mechanism were not outliers but a part of everyday life. It's a theory that, if proven, would revolutionize our understanding of ancient civilizations and their technological capabilities. The implications are profound. They speak to a world where the divide between science and mythology blurs, where our ancestors harnessed the knowledge of the cosmos not just for religious or social purposes, but for creating practical, intricate machinery. Of course, this theory is speculative and needs more evidence for full validation. However, the very existence of the Antikythera mechanism lends it a spark of plausibility. And who knows what future discoveries lie in wait under the sands of time or the depths of the seas. The Antikythera mechanism continues to be a beacon of mystery from our ancient past, a testament to the knowledge of those who came before us. If you enjoyed this deep dive into the Antikythera mechanism, remember to hit the like button and share this video with fellow history enthusiasts. Subscribe to Presapien for more intriguing insights from the annals of history. Until next time, keep exploring, and who knows what ancient mysteries we'll uncover next.